All right, so how do we sketch and start to get ideas and try out ideas and then get input on our ideas before we commit to this new process of making it into a vector? Well, that's what Proving Ground 2 is for. This is what you're going to do between now and next class. You're going to do three sketches of an idea. And you're going to do them in three different ways. So let's say that your personal political symbol is a butterfly. But it's a butterfly with electric antenna. That's what we have here. You're going to draw it in three different ways that are a good way of designing graphics for logo design. One is symmetrical. So central symmetrical design means that the center of the design is the focal point and everything grows out from there. So you can see the butterfly with the electric antennae in a symmetrical design. Dynamic is when you have the eye move across the image. Think of the Nike logo, right? And if it moves across the image at speed, usually with diagonals and with curves, then you are making a dynamic design. And then the third type is a play of positive and negative space. And positive and negative space can be tricky to sketch, but it's when the white space around your black shapes makes its own image. So let's look at some of these other designs. So this was a logo for a restaurant, for a, um, a barbecue restaurant, Fork and Bull. So the Fork and Bull, this is the central symmetrical logo. This is the dynamic one. You can see the fork and the bull. And then the positive and negative space one has black shapes that make up the fork and the night sky and this circle and then the negative space that makes this this abstracted image of a bull so that's what we're going to do for our sketches for our veteran symbol and to get full credit for this next class you need to post at least three rough sketches and they need to show each of those approaches. Central symmetrical, dynamic, play of positive and negative space. These are just small thumbnails. I'm doing them this big, pretty tiny. So I've designed my central symmetrical one. And then you're also, next class, going to comment on another student's designs and tell them which one you think is best. And if you do those two things, you'll have earned what you need for that proving ground. All right, that is it.